Welcome back, everybody, once again to Undertale. I am TJ the Obscure. You took quite a long break because of Thanksgiving and all that lovely stuff. But we are ready to get back to head to the east. Where the heck is Timmy Village at? It doesn't, it doesn't tell us where the village is at. But we are going to the Hotlands, apparently. Which we just, I mean, not that long ago, we were in a kind of snowy area, right? Uh, do I want to use the box? I guess we'll put some of this stuff up. I'm not sure what we're supposed to take and what we're not supposed to take at this point. Can I read the sign? No, I just have to go inside. That's an interesting looking gentleman there. <laughs> Such a lovely smile. Beautiful eyes. Whoa there, I've got some neat junk for sale. A crab apple. What are you looking for? It looks like a crab. CT, speed up in battle. And it heals 10 HP. Cloudy glasses. We're invincible longer. That actually doesn't sound too bad. And torn notebook has two attack. I think that tells me my current defense and attack. So this has worse defense. Why is it so expensive? I guess that also makes us invisible, in, in, invisible, invincible longer. Huh. How much? I don't have that much gold. But that sounds like it would be worth it. And then I kind of want to get one of these CTs as well. Because, you know, as soon as we clean out my inventory, the first thing that I need to do is... <laughs> Oh, is buy some more stuff. We're going to talk to this gentleman about yourself. I've been around a long time, maybe too long. Studying history sure is easy when you lived through so much of it yourself. Wahaha. Well, ha ha. That emblem. What emblem? Eh, you don't know what that is? What are they teaching you kids in school nowadays? Wahaha. Well, ha ha. That's the Delta Rune. Oh, the one in the background there. I see it. Uh, that, that's the Deltarune, the emblem of our kingdom, the kingdom of monsters. Wahahaha, <laughs> great name, huh? It's, as I always say, old King Fluffy Buns can't name for beans. Oh, we can ask him something else about, I want to ask about the king first, though. I feel like this is the first time we're hearing about the king, right? He's a friendly, happy-go-lucky kind of guy. If you keep walking around long enough, you'll probably meet him. He loves to walk around and talk to people. Eh, why do I call uh, Dreamer f Fluffy Buns? Oh, that's a great story. I don't remember it. But if you come back much later, I'm sure I'll have remembered by then. And let's ask about what's her name. Yeah, she's a local hero around here. Through grit and determination alone, she fought her way to the top of the Royal Guard. Actually, she just came through here asking about someone who looked just like you. I'd watch your back, kid. And buy some items. It might just save your hide. Okay, let's ask about the emblem again. That emblem actually predates written history. The original meaning has been lost to time. All we know is that the triangles symbolize us monsters below, and the winged circle above symbolizes something else. Most people say it's the angel from the prophecy. Ooh, what about the prophecy? Oh yeah, the prophecy. Legend has it, an angel who has seen the surface will descend from above and bring us freedom. Lately, the people have been taking a bleaker outlook, calling that winged circle the Angel of Death, a harbinger of destruction waiting to free us from this mortal realm. In my opinion, when I see that little circle, I just think it looks neat. I agree, guy. I also think you look neat. So, so very handsome. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's go ahead and equip stuff, I guess. Now the question is, do we go down or do we go over? Let's go down first. Where there is water that we cannot swim in for what reason, we do not know. I assume that's water. <laughs> it looks like it could be lots of other things, too. Yay, some more music. Hurt, beaten, and fearful for our lives, we surrender to the humans. Seven of their greatest magicians seal this underground with a magic spell. Anything can enter through the seal, but only beings with a powerful soul can leave. 
There is only one way to reverse this spell. If a huge power equivalent to seven human souls attacks the barrier, it will be destroyed. Oh gosh, we're in the water again. We cannot seem to swim down the water though, which makes zero sense. But this cursed place has no entrances or exits. There is no way a human could come here. We will remain trapped down here forever. How sad. Are there... Oh, oh, there are bad guys, apparently. Special enemy Ten Temi appears here to defeat you. But it kind of looks like a cat, I guess. I think it's supposed to be a cat. Maybe it looks so friendly, too. We are going to feed Temi. Feed Temi flakes. We're going to flex. We're going to talk. Let's try talking to Temi. You say hello to Temi. Oh, I'm, I'm Temi. Gosh, okay. It smells like Temi flakes. Let's flex. You flex at Temi. No, muscles are not cute. Temi, are you okay? No, no. Hi. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Okay, big muscles coming out of nowhere. Aaron is ready for your next flex. Um, do we flex back? I forget what we do here. Aaron flexes very hard. He flexes himself out of the room. There we go. Okay, well, that's one way to take him down, but next time we'll probably try to feed Temmie. I don't know if we're supposed to be trying to do that or not. Oh, oh, turn on the mushroom lights. Why can't I walk over there? That was weird. I like these trees here. And I like the little squeaky noises, too. More mold small, huh? It's, mold small is very normal, yes. Sits motionless. Um, check. It's a slime mold. Its attack doesn't even <laughs> sit around long enough. We're gonna imitate. What are you? Oh my gosh. Okay. Ow. This attack is actually kind of painful. Ouch. Moldy bug needs some distance. Unhug. You don't hug moldy bug. It appreciates your respect of its boundaries. Chased wiggle. Oh my gosh. What are you? You're shooting like Cheerios out of your mouth. Seems comfortable with your presence. Um, lie down. Multibug lies down too, and Multibug understands life now. Not more of the Cheerios. Gosh, I guess it could also be Fruit Loops. <laughs> Any kind of looped cereal would work here. I don't know why it has to be cereal. Multibug seems comfortable with your presence. Uh, hug? You hug Multibug. Gross slime covers you, your speed decreased. Goo. Oh, you didn't like that. Honestly, slower speed kind of helped me there. Huh? Fine. Oh, I guess we just spare them. That almost looks like it unlocked a different path here, huh? Or maybe we do go all the way around to get to it. I was thinking maybe we needed to backtrack. Indeed, we do seem to need to backtrack. Oh my gosh, there's hidden paths. Oh! <gasps> Oh gosh, I don't like this. Is this the Temi village or whatever? That's what this looks like. They look dis like happy, but kind of disturbed as well. Like the reason they're happy is not a good reason. Boy, welcome to Tem village. Boy, I'm Temi. And this is my friend, Temi. 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 Is this like a South Park reference? Because that's what immediately comes to mind for me is Temi. Temi. Rich history of Tim. <laughs> okay. I never did figure out that snail race thing. Oi, you should check out Tim Shop. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Should check Tim Shop. Oh, you all are really annoying me right now. Oh, aha, humans. Such a cute. Such a cute, yes. Tim, watch egg. Egg will hatch. Tim, proud parent. Aw, that's sweet. A statue of Tim. Very famous. Very. Can we hatch the egg? It's... Well, that's not good. 
Did Tim hardboil her her own child? Uh, put Tim heard human aller allergics to them. That okay. Tim understand. Tim also allergic to Tim. Uh oh, that's not good. Uh, hives. <laughs> Mushroom dance, mushroom dance, whatever could it mean? It means you've lived a life of sin. <gasps> How dare you? We just met. How would you possibly know that? I guess if it's if it's a fungus, it could be a very large fungus that has an eye on everything, huh? Feeling of being watched by the fungus. Yes, watched by the fungus. You feel something. You're filled with determination. Oh, you know, I, it's funny. I'm sure... Previously, I would have just ignored it, but I've started seeing comments on social media that reference this game now, and I'm like, oh, I finally get that. Okay. It feels good to be in the know, finally. Oh my gosh, this music is not good. We're going to buy Tim Flake. Tim Flake on sale. Discount food of Tim. 20 Tim Flake expensive. Tim pay for college. I wish I could help you pay for college, dude, but I don't have that kind of money. So I'm gonna give you the least amount of money possible. Sure. And then we'll talk to you. Say hello. Oi, I'm Timmy. Oi. Uh, is that all of it? Us Tems have a deep history. <laughs> it's good to know. What about your shop? Yeah, yeah, go to Tim shop. All right. I'm not really sure what the purpose of this place is, but does it have to have a purpose? It was kind of hidden to begin with. Yeah, why didn't that one light up whenever I turned on the lamp? I feel like that should have happened. Are there any other hidden paths here? That would be good to know. Washua and Aaron appear. We are going to clean Washua. Or why I guess Washua is going to clean us. Green means clean. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that, you, yep, okay, we got the green. We got the green, we're good. We're good. Aaron is admiring his own muscles. Um, we can now spare. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. I don't I don't know if I've gotten that one before. We told him to go away and he he left. He's a good listener. Okay. Around and around the mushrooms we go. The music is so serious. Without candles or magic to guide them home, the monsters use crystals to navigate. I don't know why it's making that noise. Which direction do we go? Why whenever we... Uh, I guess maybe like the lamp is... I get it. it. It momentarily lights things up, but not very well. And then otherwise we have to rely on the crystals. Does it eventually get like super duper dark to where we can't even see? Oh, it does. Well, that's kind of terrifying. I don't like that. All it means though is we just gotta keep the light on, right? What is that? Is that Motel 6? <laughs> keep the light on for you? Oh, you two again, huh? What if... I don't know if I want to do that. Fine, we will clean you. Get the, get the green! Get the green! Ouch, man, that that attack really hurts. Um, dang, I forget what I did. Uh, okay, I guess we're going this way. I don't know. I don't know which way we're supposed to go. 
Oh, this is not good. This is not good. Okay, there we go. Is this a path? No, that is not a path. Okay, let's go back and hit the lamp before we continue on. I don't know which direction we want to be going. I assume in this direction, though. Okay, I see a lamp not too far away. Gosh, you guys are so annoying. Can I just run away? Oh my gosh. Okay, that was not a good idea. Why do I feel like I'm taking more damage than normal? Aaron is looking around fearful of something. Um... Well, we'll get rid of Washua. Although, I feel fear that we are gonna die right now. Oh, we need to get the green. We did not get the green. Smells like an underwater barn barnyard. Okay, I definitely need to, like, eat or something, right? That did not recover very much. Does not recover very much at all. Aaron is sweating bullets. Uh, sure. Okay. Okay, let's, um, once again, clean and try to get the thing, green thing. Okay, I think we're gonna make it out of here alive. But we still need to be careful. I need to figure out a way to heal. Why are you looking around fearful of something, huh? I wonder if I could have just done that from the very beginning. Or not. Okay, bandage? Sure, we'll use a bandage. Still kind of gooey, you recovered 10 HP. Let's just, let's move on. I hate invisible mazes like this, I really do. It's so dark. Behind me is just a wall, though. Oh. Well, I'm glad I healed a little bit. This could end badly. Seven, seven human souls. With the power of seven human souls, our king, King Asgore Dreamer, will become a god. With that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier. He will finally take the surface back from humanity and give them back the suffering and pain that we have endured. Oh, so that old dude was lying? Understand, human, this is your only chance at redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body. Somebody's gonna save me, right? The flowers? I'll help you fight! Uh oh. No. Poor little kid. Yo, you did it! Undyne is right in front of you! You've got front row seats to her fight! Uh oh. Poor kid. About to learn that his uh, hero is. Wait, I'm, I'm very confused. Is Undyne, like, blind or something? I'm, I'm very confused. What was just going on? You aren't going to tell my parents about this, are you? Um, huh. Okay. Very confused. You hear a passing conversation. Hmm. If I say my wish, you promise you won't laugh at me? Of course I won't laugh. Is this the same one as before? Someday I'd like to climb this mountain we're all buried under. Standing under the sky, looking at the world all around, that's my wish. Hey, you said you wouldn't laugh at it. Sorry, it's just funny. That's my wish, too. Aw. How sweet. However, there is a prophecy. The angel, the one who has seen the surface, they will return and the underground will go empty. Aw. Am I here to kill everybody? Is that my task? That bridge does not look very safe. That is... Oh, that's not a bridge. That's what's holding up the bridge, apparently. Yo! What are you doing back, dude?
Yo, I know I'm not supposed to be here, but I want to ask you something. How did you escape Undyne? Man, I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, yo, you're human, right? Man, I knew it. Well, I know it now. I mean, Undyne told me, um, stay away from that human. So, like, um, I guess that makes us enemies or something. But I kind of stink at that. Ha, <laughs> yo, uh, say something mean so I can hate you, please? No. I don't want to say anything mean. I, I don't barely even know you. I mean, I could talk stuff. I could say things about your head. Your body right now looks like a beehive. And I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what else. But I could, but I'm not going to. Here goes nothing. Yo, I, I hate your guts. Man, I, I'm such a turd. I'm, I'm gonna, that's such a funny word, you got to admit. I'm going to go home now. I just, my best friend growing up just loved that word, turd. The word turd. Yo, wait, help, I tripped. Uh-oh. See, we helped the, the monster, we saved the monster, we're all friends now, right? Uh, yeah, yeah yo, dude, if, if you, you want to hurt my friend, you're going to have to get through me first. Oh, really? Dude must have some crazy special powers or something, like, might look small, but he's feisty. Or they just didn't want to attack a child. Yo, you really saved my skin. Guess being enemies was just a nice thought. Haha. -ha. Well, or we'll just have to be friends instead. Man, I should really go home. I bet my parents are worried sick about me. Later, dude. What about my parents? Where are my parents at, huh? Are they worried sick about me, too? Seems like an utterly pointless room, does it not? Why is this here? Why did we not just go immediately here? I don't know, I feel like I should be checking for secrets constantly. That's a big cave. Yeah, you told us. You told us already. Yeah, first, however, as is customary for those who something or other, I shall tell you the tragic tale of our... Oh, I don't want to hear the tragic tale of your people. It also, I've heard the tragic tale. Forget it. I already understand. Is that her, like... Wait, what is that? Papyrus didn't come to his meeting today. Say what you want about him. He's weird. He's naive. He's self-absorbed. But Papyrus has never missed a meeting. And no matter what time you call him on the phone, night, day, afternoon, morning... He always answers when the first two rings. But now he's gone, and his brother isn't around, either. What did you do to him? What did you do to him? Papyrus, who I have trained every day, even though I know he's too goofy to ever hurt anyone. Go ahead, prepare however you want. But when you step forward, I will, I will kill you. Oh, we get to save now. I think that's going to have to wait for the next episode. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time.